Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I want to bring you to our favorite Indonesian cuisine restaurant. It is called The Little Bali and the restaurant is located at the Jumeirah Lakes Tower Cluster U. You could take the metro and the closest stop to the restaurant is the Shoba Realty Station. If you take the outside pedestrian route, it will be around 5 minutes walk but we decided to enjoy the lakeside view so it is a little longer than that. When you've arrived at Cluster U, you will see this cutting edge salon which is right next to the Little Bali, now we have finally arrived at the restaurant and we are making our way in. The restaurant is quite spacious and the time that we arrived, there weren't that many people so we went ahead to look at the menu. We weren't appetizer people so we didn't order any starter. We ended up ordering the ayam penyet set for my husband and ayam geprek for me. And because of the spicy nature of our orders, we would usually get the iced tea in a pitcher so that we could constantly top up. The Little Bali has their own website, Facebook and also Instagram page if you want to check out their menu. Here comes our large picture of iced tea. This is what the seatings in the restaurant looks like. And it seems like this entire area has already been reserved by either a company or a family. There's also seatings outside that you could enjoy, especially during the winter, but it's currently summer so we didn't opt for that. Finally, our meals have arrived. It comes with this basket of rice and this is my husband's order of ayam penyet while this is my order of ayam gepret. Look at those crazy crushed chilies on top of it. We also asked for kicap manis which is a sweetened soy sauce. Ayam penyet dish is served with lalapan which is a combination of raw vegetable together with a piece of fried tofu and tempeh. Ayam gepra is also served with lalapan but the topping is quite different since it is called sambal bawang as opposed to sambal terasi which is on the ayam penyet. If you like medium spicy food then I would recommend ayam penyet but if you like super spicy food then ayam geprek is for you. A lot of Indonesian cuisine are famous in Malaysia which is where we're from. I remember going to Padang Jawa to get our fix of ayam penyet between classes during my college time. As part of our culture and sunnah, we would occasionally use our clean right hand to eat our meal, so that's what my husband is doing. Another way of eating is you can pour the kicap manis onto your rice, get a piece of everything to eat together with the rice. And if you could read the As for me, I didn't use my hand because the ayam gepre is quite spicy and I'm afraid that it will linger on my hand. 
I like to drizzle the kicap manis on the chicken to sort of tone down the spiciness of the ayam geprek. Here's a more closer look of the meal. Look at those amount of crushed chilies. The best part of the chicken is this skin or the edges of it because it can get very flavorful around that area. We asked for an extra portion of the sambal terasi because I ended up taking some from my husband as well. And finally, this is the aftermath. We were super full because we finished all the rice between the two of us. I really recommend this restaurant if you would like to try authentic Indonesian cuisine and also because of the ambience. The total cost for our meal, including the drinks, was 101 dirham and 85 fills. The price is considered decent for a dine-in type of restaurant in Dubai and also considering the location. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye! Your voice lead in the choir to sing If you don't mind me asking to be heard My heart beats with yours You can take me on I'm falling deep and won't take